Hello YouTube! We can hardly think of a day without our phones. That little box of wonder makes us connected with our loving ones. But have you ever thought what actually happens when you press that green button? It's probably you're using GSM technology to transfer your voice to your loving ones, since most of the world use it. Basically, there are three sections of the GSM architecture. Mobile station, base station subsystem, and network switching subsystem. Before we dig deeper, let's know something about what is cell and what is radio channel. A cell is a geographical area. Your area is divided into several cells and each cell is served by at least one BTS or base transceiver station or as you see as a mobile tower. And channels are the logical medium of radio communication. That means channel is the band of frequency by which you are connected to your mobile tower. When we switched on our phone, it tried to search for a SID, system identification number. If it finds any, then it compares it with one that is stored on the phone. If no SID found, that is when you see no service available on your mobile phone screen. And the moment comes, you press the green button and wanting to talk with your loving one. What is actually happening? You are sending a call setup request. Your request initially handled by your area's phone tower or BTS. And BTS then passing your request to its master. MSC, Mobile Switching Center, the heart of the architecture. MSC is a central component of the system. It acts like a switching node and can route your call to your desired location. Before that, it determines your location identity, your desired person's location identity, your billing information, your authentication, your registration, your equipment registration, and if everything goes right, MSC routes the call to your requested area's MSC. Then that MSC finds your desired user's location and pass the call to that area's BTS. BTS then pass the call to the user's mobile station. Now a question came. How there are so many BTS are operating without interruption or crosstalking? To control and manage the BTS, there are another station called Base Station Controller. It acts as a mediator between the BTS and MSC. It also allocates radio resource to the base station. It also responsible for radio call setup to initiate call for frequency hopping and handovers. So in short, what is happening? You are attempting to make a call. Your call is going to BTS, to MSC, to another BTS, to your corresponding person. And several BTS is maintained by a base station controller. And that is all happening behind the scene. So gigs, that's all for today. I am hoping to make some more video. Please subscribe my channel. Thumbs up if you like this video and comment below. Let me know what you are thinking.